Hi, I'm Dr. John Carney, a veterinarian at Pets Incorporated. I'm here today to talk about feline viral rhinotracheitis, also known as feline herpes virus type 1. Um, it's a viral disease um, that only cats can get. It's not contagious to people, not contagious to dogs. Um, and today we have two cats here that um, are uh, that have it right now. Um, Heidi and Helen. This is Helen. This is Heidi. Uh, they came in a couple months ago. This is Helen. Um, she has a little bit worse condition. Um, she's probably mostly blind. Um, her her left eye is almost you know completely closed. Her right eye she can see a little bit. Um, but we've had her um, in the isolation room. She's been doing pretty well. Um, and we're going to put them up for adoption soon. Um, the, uh, the, the key thing to remember is that feline herpes virus is always, they're always going to carry it in them. They'll never get rid of it. But the good thing is, uh, most of the time, they, um, you know, they're just silent carriers for it. They don't actively shed it all the time. Um, usually only when they're stressed or they have another condition going on, uh, their immune system can be suppressed and then the, the herpes virus can come back out. This one's Heidi. Um, she's a little bit better off. Um, she has a little bit of a corneal scar on her left eye. Uh, her right eye is pretty much normal. Um, I'm gonna put her back. <laughs> a little bit feisty. Um, uh, now there is a vaccine for it, and the vaccine is, is pretty good. Um, it's mostly for uh, to prevent the uh, the transmission of the of the virus. Uh, it doesn't stop it completely. Uh, but it does suppress it, um, kind of like the flu vaccine in people. Uh, it doesn't completely stop it, but it prevents it from getting really bad. Lysine can be given to uh, cats with feline herpes virus, um, and that's supposed to suppress the, the viral replication, it's supposed to help boost their immune system. Um, cats with it, uh, are, it's good to give them uh, a good, healthy diet, uh, keep them in a fairly stress-free environment, stress can bring the, the virus back out again. Okay, they're up for adoption. Um, they can probably go to just about any home. Um, probably would be best if they were in a, in a house with no other cats. That would be the ideal option. Um, maybe one dog um, or maybe a, cat, a house with uh, no other cats. Um, that'd be perfect. That'd be fairly stress-free for them. Yes, they can be around other cats um, and there's a vaccine for it. Um, the vaccine is good for all cats as long as they're not sick.